best thing about marriage? Um, um. Happy life. Happy marriage is a bond between husband and wife. <laughs> it's like a date that never ends. A date that never ends? Well, when there are two of you, you can share food. That, that is so true. So that, that's definitely part. Good. Sharing food is good. Um, knowing you, you, knowing that you have each other uh, to take you th through things and um, having a soulmate. Mm -hmm. Yes. Definitely, it's something to be there for you whenever you need them, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. And to look after me properly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well looked after. Okay. I have two beautiful kids. Oh, marriage is um, it's having your soulmates, really. Oh, it's yeah. nice. It's uh. How did you know she, he or she was the one? I just knew. How? Um, from the moment I met you. She didn't choose me, her sister chose me. No! <laughs> <laughs> uh, when I met Biju first time, I found him so funny, so then I thought he's the one for me. Well, I saw somewhere in a function or some kind of... Two one or two. How we saw each other. <laughs> We know each other. We such, live together. We live like, a, okay, we live <laughs> opposite each other and we saw and it's like a first sight. I said, oh, so, you know, it looked like uh, she say yes, then I'm lucky to be having my partner. Yeah, like I think, I mean, I always had a, you know, connection that we can't really you know, it could never be found with other people. Yeah. So it's kind of new. I don't know how to explain it. Oh, oh my God. Oh, I know, I know, I know. One of the days that we went out before we got married, when we first met, and Nima probably remembers me talking about this, I spilled an entire cup of soda, glass of soda, in his lap the second day we met. And we're still married 20 years later. Beautiful girl with a U.S. citizenship. <laughs> Chemistry and uh, her, her red Mercedes, she came and impressed me with her. Mm. Yeah. I, was, I, was, I was impressed by her red Mercedes. I had no idea whether he was the one for me, but um, there was something about him um, that I liked. Uh, I think he was um, he was pretty smart. He, he knew what he was doing. He was very confident. And I think he, he actually bullshitted his way through to me. And I fell for it. Ah! What's the most romantic thing that you've done together? Watch NFL football. And watch the Giants spank the Cowboys. <laughs> we worked 22 years together and understand each other. I'm not a romantic person, so I can't answer that. And listening to the flute music uh, in uh, uh, Kandalama, that was, that was very romantic, with sunset and all that. When Jay used to drive a hundred miles to come and see me at university, and he used to come and surprise me in the middle of the night, he used to work in Cranley, and he'd come to Portsmouth just on a whim, and it was the nicest surprise ever. I remember is when they, they gave me a surprise for my 40th birthday. They went away from leaving all you kids behind and it was just the two of us. Was it in Wiltshire? Somewhere in Wiltshire. Gloucestershire. Gloucestershire. I was beautiful. To be fair, she was living with my best friend at the time at college, so I just <laughs> come and see him as well. But yeah, 100 million. Okay. What habit did you wish you'd known before marrying them? I mean, in your mom's case... In, in your mom's case, 
she stopped stop talking, it'd be brilliant. <laughs> Her obsessive compulsive disorder. Oh. Snoring. He's perfect. I don't have any bad habits. <laughs> <laughs> Jay forgets everything. He wa he wants to be right all the time. <laughs> he leaves things everywhere. Ah, there's nothing I would like to change about you. Nothing. He forgets things. I can remind him. Smoking. I can send him a text message. I can put a note on it, and he just forgets. One word missing in her dictionary, and that's a no. N O. <laughs> She never said no to anybody for anything. Passport. He took my passport to the airport to check in. Or he gets mad so easy. Okay. He forgets everything. What do you love the most about your partner? His sense of humor. He's 40, but he still acts like he's six. I like she when she always smart. Can't really say on camera. Oh really? <laughs> oh wow! Maybe you can tell me later. Uh, understanding you. Her cooking. She's an incredible cook. Just being there, everything so really. Kind and very considerate. Mm. Yeah. Just him being there. And the way she looks after my mum and my kids is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. Um, I'd say it's the fact that you're the one of the most kindest, most affectionate people I could have ever shared, oh. shared my life with. I think. I think. I think they say behind every successful man that there, there, there is a great woman, and, and no doubt that's who you are. I think if it wasn't for you, um, I probably wouldn't achieve half the things that I've achieved. Thank you. Okay. And her looks, of course. I think uh, it just makes me really happy. What is the secret to a long and happy marriage? Uh, Why? <laughs> Compromise. Never had anything. Perfect. You know, always say truth. Laughter. Oh, why laughter? Laughter. Um. One word, tolerance. <laughs> Argue. Argue and, and make up. Arguing is, is healthy, it's great, um, but make sure you spend quality time with one another. The last thing I would like to say is marriage is not just about two people, it's about two families. And I think the secret behind uh, keeping everybody happy is support each other's family. That's all I'm going to say. And I agree with you. I think you get more out of it when two families get married. Good luck to you guys. I think. And and for me, I think it's um. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and they can say whatever they want, but you can actually hear them. And if you close your eyes, you can't even see them, and you can go to a happy place. <laughs> we can't. We have to do this video again.